What's up guys, it's Josh back with another video and today I'm going to show you guys how to make the Steph Curry build in NBA 2K22 current gen. Obviously Steph Curry is a point guard, he's right handed and he wears number 30. For the pie chart you guys want to scroll all the way down to the one that's half green and half yellow right here. And then for the physical profile you guys want to choose the top pie chart, this is going to make you as fast as possible. Now for the attributes on this build, we're going to start with the shooting, we're going to max everything out see how many shooting badges we can get and we can actually get 25 but in order to keep more attribute points you guys want to lower your post fade all the way to 78 so you still get 25 but you get five extra attribute points then for the playmaking you guys want to just max out your pass accuracy and ball handle and you don't want to drop anything because as you can see if you drop your pass accuracy or your ball handle by one you lose a playmaking badge so you just want to max these two out don't touch your post control at all now that we're done with shooting and playmaking let's go back up to finishing so you want to max out your driving layup and then if you want to you can max out your driving dunk but honestly i don't think it's worth it because you use all these attribute points you don't get any extra finishing badges and your dunk packages aren't even going to be that good so honestly i wouldn't even touch a dunk at all if you really want to you could put it up to like 50 so you get some dunks if you don't want to just be laying up the ball every time but for the sake of this video i'm not going to touch my dunking i'm going to save some attribute points and i'm going to get some extra defensive badges so going down to the defense you want to max out your perimeter defense lateral quickness and steal these are the main three attributes and then to get badges you guys want to max out your rebounding max out your block and then put the rest into interior defense until you get 10 defensive badges and then for the last two attribute points it doesn't really matter where you put them i'm gonna put them into the dunk maybe that'll trigger some more dunk animations and if you really don't care about defense that much you could lower your defense a little bit to get some driving dunk but i think this is the best way to get this build for the body shape you guys want to go with burly <laughs> I'm just kidding. For the body shape, you guys want to go with either compact or slight, whichever one looks better. I think compact looks better. For the height, I know Steph Curry is six foot three, but for the sake of this build, I would go with six foot four because your ball handle is still going to be above 86 once we touch the wingspan, and your speed only drops by one. And I feel like it's a lot easier to play defense the taller you are, so that extra inch of height is going to help. Then for the weight, you guys want to go one above the minimum. It doesn't really matter that much, but I just go one above the minimum, so my post control is 39 and not 38. And nothing else is affected so it may as well just go 176 and not 175. now for the wingspan you can do one of two things so the first thing you can do is just totally drop your wingspan you'll get a 91 3 which will eventually go to 95 and 99 overall and you'll get an 86 ball handle off the rip so you'll be able to speed boost right away and the second thing you guys can do is drop your wingspan by two so you can speed boost right away your three-pointer will only be an 88 but it'll be a lot easier to play defense because when your arms are longer you can get steals a lot easier and you can contest shots a lot easier so if i were to make this build i would take a hit on my three because it only goes down by three from a 91 to an 88 and your defense will be a lot better so this is what i would do but it's totally up to you guys you can definitely be fine with a 91 3 and shorter wingspan and here's the build it's called a playmaking shot creator and as you can see the top comparison is stephen curry 